guys, so this first thing I'm using is this L'Oreal True Match Foundation and I'm just applying it all over my face and buffing it into my skin with this Real Technique Stippling Brush. Next I'm going in with my Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer and just applying this to my dark circles and a little bit further just to kind of highlight my cheekbones a bit and I'm using that same stippling brush just to kind of blend it all out. As always, all the products will be listed in the description box. Next I'm going in with my NYX Matte Bronzer because I'm all out of my favorite NYC Sunny Bronzer but this is not bad either and I'm just contouring my cheeks and up into my forehead. Next, using this Maybelline blush stick, I'm just applying a bit to my fingers and then just blending it into the apples of my cheeks for a nice peachy, corally color. Alright guys, I'm sorry, this is the one product I always use that's high-end in my drugstore makeup tutorials. I love this Anastasia Brow Wiz, and if you're going to get anything high-end, this is definitely one of my favorite things. Next, I'm going in with this NYX Jumbo Pencil in the color Milk and just applying this all over my lid as a base. This white color really, really helps all the drugstore eyeshadow colors just really pop really nicely and I love using it. And then I'm going in with this Maybelline Quad and using this matte shade and just buffing it all into the crease. I love this color and this is in the Chai Latte Quad. A lot of drugstore eyeshadows aren't really matte so that's why I love this one. And then I'm taking this dark brown color on a pencil brush and just working it into the outer corner just to darken it up a bit. Next I'm going in with this gorgeous color from L'Oreal Infallible and this is the color Amber Rush and I'm just using my finger to apply it because I feel like it works a lot better like that and it's a lot more bold when you do it that way. And so I just think this is such a pretty color. I've been wearing this so many times. I've been wearing it in tons of my videos so this is like one of my new favorite looks. Next I'm going back in with that matte color and just working it into my lower lashes. After that, I'm also applying some more of that Amber Rush under my lower lash line as well. Since I'm not going to be using liner down there, I really like to define it with eyeshadow. So then I'm just curling my lashes and applying some L'Oreal Miss Manga Mascara. So I'm just doing a couple coats of that on my upper and lower lashes. I also sometimes like using very thin, natural looking false lashes with this look, which is also very pretty. But just for a more everyday look, we aren't really using lashes. So then I'm just going in with this Revlon lip butter and we are all done. I hope you all enjoyed this look. It's great for back to school or just every day and I'll see you all next time. Don't forget to subscribe. I post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Bye!